PvP is an essential part of the Coromon post game. Upon traveling to the basement of any trainer hub, you'll be able to connect to the online service in order to battle via ranked 3v3 once the first season of competitive PvP begins, or a casual setting with friends or rivals. From this menu, you can also select your squad by adding Coromon from either your PC or current party and attach items and movesets to them seamlessly without having to change around your single player sets. You're also given a plethora of stylization options, which include adjusting your personal avatar, adjusting your username, changing up the battle music when you face off, the battle background that you'll be fighting in, and you can even pick a cute little taunt for your character. I'm evil. Ranked Season 1 will be 3 on 3 battles while Casual runs the option of 3v3 or otherwise custom settings. In the custom options, you can choose how many squad members you'd like to have, whether or not to set Coromon to level 50, and whether or not to allow for duplicates whether they be items or Coromon. You can then find a random opponent online or use a custom code to set up a private match. The team over at Tragsoft and Freedom Games are very interested in keeping the competitive scene alive by having various seasons, cross-platform communication when Switch goes live, and will be looking into supporting esports competitions. Coromon is just a day away on Steam, so make sure to get your squads ready and shine bright.